Welcome back to Warhammer 40k Gladius. I am Blizzard Star, and he is Shadowcat, and he's going to kick my butt today, I think. Maybe. There what? is one thing that could stop that. What? Unless the I game, can... The game could crash again. It could crash. It'd be the <laughs> gods telling us, okay, enough of this. Just leave. Just go. Yeah. So, thankfully, Warhammer auto-saves, which means that after it crashed last time, we haven't lost a whole lot. Like, barely anything. I'm still fighting all these army things over here with my brand new shiny monolith. That's exciting. And he's still conquering and killing my units. Oh yeah, I might also be laying siege over here. Speaking of that, siege them. Oh, you be nice. Continue sieging them. Thank you. Oh no! And there is one unit down. Alright. My tomb blades. Your two blades are a scrap. Well, you know what? Next <laughs> turn, guys, get in there. I thought you were trying to, uh, you know, protect your tomb blades. Aha, uh -huh, I can move him in now. Oh, right, and you want me to go over here and do this? Okay, fine. Zap them! <laughs> I love my monolith. And you guys need to repair. And then pull back. I mean, if it's working for the orcs, why don't we do the same thing? Pull back to the city and let the city help fight. Who right? says it's working for me? Oh, that's all I have left. <laughs> oh, I can't heal them yet. It's still on recharge. Um, okay. Execute queued orders. Oh yeah, I forgot I had more troops coming. Oh, goody. Order units. You guys have already been... Oh, okay. Zappy zappy. Zappy zappy? I don't want to know what that means. Oh, they have better zappy than I do. Ah, uh, okay. Gotcha. Ooh. My city does a lot of damage. I'm sure it does. It's a high-tech uh, city. With very miserable people. Oh my. They have more... They, they have more troops than I do. Ow! Stop it! So you're fighting a war on two fronts. That's I usually, am fighting a war on two fronts, yes. That's usually a bad idea. It is usually a bad idea. Ooh! Necro damage repair costs influence. Um, I didn't realize that. Oh, jeez. <laughs> Do you see the shit, guys? Do you uh, see the growth? <laughs> Nothing there. Look at that. Look at can this. I blow that up? Sure. Oh, that whatever. barely did anything. It doesn't matter. Okay, keep blowing things up. Um, wait a minute. I know that I had Necron Warriors over here when I left. They kind of got blasted to smithereens. Well, stop that. Even the Orc uh, City is very tough. I'm surprised. Yes. Yes, it is. Huh. Is there anything that I can do? Nope. Not really. Okay, well, skip you for now. <gasps> I got a Doomsday Arc. That sounds dangerous. Look at it. It's so pretty. 
Well, I'm glad you're having fun with your toys. Now, let's bring it over here so they can blow it up. Don't you it want to... So, it sounds so ominous. When you wanted to protect it, why would you want them to blow it up on you? Uh, I would rather they didn't blow it up, but I feel like my consent in having it blown up isn't really required. That's fair. Uh, so let's see. Tomb Blades, Doomsday Arc, Monolith. I really don't want you to make any more of those. So just kind of hold off on that for now. Wait, you have a name. A Destroyer Lord? That sounds scary. And they just killed my troops. This makes me unhappy. Wow, they're tough. Okay, blow them up. All right, so who did you shoot last time? You shot them. Okay. Heal them. <laughs> Any damage done, they can easily re be repaired. Oh, well. It's like trying to knock down a brick wall with a BB gun. Yeah, pretty much. Reconstructing fundamental particles. Or knock down a brick wall with a water balloon full of whipped cream. Okay, well that was a bizarre thing to lead with. A water balloon filled with whipped cream. Well, yeah. You Suddenly know. I'm starting to question how you spend your free time. <laughs> Oh, wouldn't you want to know? Well, now I kind of do. <laughs> it's lots of fun. Oh, that's on cooldown. Man, I don't like fighting Necron units. We don't play fair. Oh, I wonder why. Could be possibly because they're the bad guys? And then the Goss Flare Array? Oh, that was cool. That's, that was so cool. That sounds dangerous. And what's this? Uh, jinking? No, we don't need to jink. And your stalker is no longer stalking. Okay, wants me to order a city? Um, I really don't have any orders for you. So, just end it. That sounded ominous. Stop killing my warriors. <sighs> Who? The other Necrons or me? Yes. <laughs> Oh, 
this is a slog. This is like going through a swamp and bare feet. Shoot him! Shoot him! Shoot him! Okay, that was kind of cool. It was kind of cool. It was useless, that but it was cool. Zappy zappy. No, you want to know it's useless? Why? Mind shackle scarabs. Yeah, they seem pretty useless. I don't know why you have them. Wait, can I not use it on that? Apparently not. Reduce the morale of target enemy unit. Well, I guess your city is not technically a unit. It's not. It's kind of it's a really city. Not. Can I blind it? I guess I really can't do anything right now. Okay. Yeah. Forget that. Okay, end turn. That would be good against the Necron you're fighting up north. Probably. <laughs> but he's not up north. No. He's down south. Eh, fair enough. You better not kill him. I don't even know where he is, to be fair. I'm kind of going to target things that are actually hurting me, so... I think your scarab is fine. Take one more unit out with me before I go. That's kind of how I'm feeling right now over here. <laughs> I don't think Take you're... as many things out as I can. Oh my, I didn't realize he's that badly damaged. Uh, can I change my order? Can I go back? Oh, I cannot go back. I'm not going to get there fast enough. It's one unit out of three. His name is Dave. I feel bad for Dave, but he's going to be scrap metal next turn before you blow me up. Can I heal him from here? Oh, I can't heal him from <gasps> here. I done done anything I did. <laughs> Dave shall live. No, it's his units. That's Dave's units. They're all Dave. That's the secret. That's scary. <laughs> We're all Dave here. They have no personalities outside of being Dave. There is only Dave. <laughs> and Dave, if you're watching, you'll understand. Sure, will he now? It's a secret code known only to Dave's. You're not a Dave, though, so. I know secret things. <laughs> you join the cult of Dave. They're all here. Okay, I think that's their last lord. Let's see if we can kill it. Hit him with everything! Okay, and now that we've healed them, get back in there and do your lightning thing. Lightning thing? Yeah. One more turn. How is it still standing? Because it's... the orcs believe it will stand. Apparently, it's probably so full of bullet holes that it's not even funny anymore. The wall is nothing but bullet holes. It's just one big hole. And yet it still stands because the orcs believe it so. They believe, they believe it to uh, stand, so it will stand. 
until I can't stand no more. Pretty much. <laughs> now I kill this hero. Wow, you are tough. Heroes usually are? We'll lightning it to death. No, you no. won't. That didn't work. Not All right, quite. unceremonious death then. Through, Bring it down! Through a million bullets. And there it goes. And it crumpled. At last, the orc kneels reluctantly dead to the ground. The wah! Finally, fall silent. Green bodies and blood lit the ground everywhere, entangled with crude machinery and firearms. Snotlings and squigs pick over their carcasses up for food. The orc threat to Gladius Prime has been dealt with, but isn't the loss for the orcs exactly? After all, they had a really good fight, which is all orcs ever wanted. There's never an end to the orcs, even though you and your boys are returning to the mud. Your dying bodies will spread spores to every continent on this planet. Should the plant survive, before too long, a new generation of orcs will emerge from the moist shadows, hungry to fight again. After untold millennia, you have finally reclaimed your world from the Old One's scions. Now, nothing walks on the surface of Gladius Prime that isn't Necron or a slave. You can start the long task of uncovering the remaining tomb complexes and scouring the surface of the enemy's ramshackle structures. Who knows what awaits outside the warp storm? The old ones? The Satan? With time, you're sure the psychic maelstrom will subside, and you will find out. When it does, you will be prepared, your armies replenished and rebuilt. But you're in no rush. You've already waited aeons, after all. For your final vengeance, you can wait a little longer. And that is it. That is our playthrough of Gladius. I had lasers. I had nothing at the end. I'm just happy I had lasers. Well, lasers were advantageous for you. It did do well. I mean, y you could go with other races that are probably stronger, like the Space Marines, but hey, they don't have lasers. Bad, they don't. They have just big guns that will blow you away. But they're not lasers. <laughs> no, they're not. Anyway, that is the end of Necron vs. Orcs. Uh, not sure if we're going to do another one of these. We may take a break from Warhammer for a while. Yeah. So, till then, till we make a decision on that. We will bid you hope, adieu. Yep, I hope everyone's going to have a good day. And we're out of here. See you later. Bye. Take care. <laughs>